this is the Bat Island Silver Duck, best ASA softball bats there are. Today I'm here to bring you a bat review of the 2020 Monster Black Sheep. This is still in the wrapper. We're going to unwrap it and get some initial swings on it. A special thanks to Heather Nowak. She sent this to me to try it out. If you ever see her on Facebook selling a bat, I wouldn't hesitate to purchase from her. So thank you again, Heather. Ooh, I was expecting this to be uh, have the shine on it, but it's got a matte finish. That is sharp, really bright. But yet it's got a shine to it, yet it's a matte finish. Wow, that is sharp looking. Woo! All right, let's give it some swings. Uh, but first, here's a quick look at one of the products I'll be using for the review. In my opinion, the green pitching machine by Pop Toss is one of the best inventions for the slow pitch softball world. As you can tell by the name of the product, it is a pitching machine that launches 12-inch softballs and you don't need batteries, you don't need electricity, and it comes with a lifetime warranty. My family purchased one of these for me in 2018 for my birthday and I've loved it since day one. It's a great product to have if you want more live batting practice and you don't have a pitcher to throw to you. Down below you'll notice the link where you can purchase one of these. Be sure to use my affiliate code LIVEBP and save $8. As well as if you're looking for more information, you can check out my other reviews that I've done uh, in the links down below of this fantastic product. All right, we're time for some swings. Come on, black sheep, show us what you got. I got some pavement out there, the 300 or so. I got the wind a little bit in my favor. Now this is a, construct. hey, that one got the pavement. Construction wise, this is the 200 or 2000 uh, in 17, 18, and 19, I think it is, uh, torch. Uh, so, this is the same uh, construction, except it, as far as I understand it, uh, except it's got a half ounce end load in it, which you can definitely tell. Uh, so, uh, you know, I've heard people talk about that they want to try the monster or they like it, but they, they like uh, a half ounce end load or something. This one, uh, we'll see how it does, but this one could be. A good one to look at for that. You can definitely feel that end load. Uh, it's a 3900 flex handle. My understanding is that the different flexes of handles are coming back for Monster, but still right now this is the 3900. Uh, it's got a nice thin handle. If you like the thin handle, well that one will get it easy. There you go. So this is a third generation FIB, the floating inner barrel, the M2 construction. It's a cold weather bat. It's only supposed to be used with low compression balls. So 52, 300, 52, 275. There we go. Last year, I finally started liking the, the torch. Right at the end there. So I've been excited to get this one out and try it. Oh yeah. Just short. Oh, that's a bad swing. Got excited. Come on, black sheep. There you go. Uh, just you know, with this pop toss, you can adjust the timer. I use it as a workout, as well as for videos, and I have it on faster. There you go. Now, there is another bat almost just like this, really. It's the Torch Juiced. That one uh, only comes in 25 and a half ounce, but same as the 25 and a half ounce Black Sheep. So this one comes in 25 and a half ounce and 26 and a half ounce. 
Uh, but torch juice in this same bat. Two piece bat, ASA only. One more off the pop toss. Then we're gonna get some more swings on it. We'll get it inside off the radar. Did a couple quick swings with the Anarchy Pitbull. Boy, this is really making its way to the Almost Gamer. I've been liking this bet a lot. Come on, Pitbull. Ah, it just feels so great. There you go. This is a 12 inch barrel, a half on send load. All right, Torch, I should say Black Sheep, you get the last one. Show us what you got. Oh, yeah, we gotta do one more. All right, here you go. Oh. All right, well, I'm definitely liking the feel of that through the zone. So far, we are going to get some more swings on it, get it broken in, and then we'll give it a chance to go up against the gamer on the radar. We will be back. All right, we have 800 swings on the Monster Black Sheep. It is time to put it back on the radar using the Worth Hot Dot Psycho Ball SYCO. This one has a good amount of swings on it. Let's see how the Black Sheep is doing and give some opinion here. 86 miles it per hour. It is a hot one in here in Milwaukee today. 90 miles per now, hour. In terms of uh, looks, I mean, this bat looks fantastic. That blue on uh, there is actually quite bright. Paint has held up nice for 800 swings. Uh, hasn't really gone in the dirt, but it's held up real nice. I like the simplistic look. 91 miles per hour. In terms of sound, it's got a fantastic sound. The, the, the clack is on there. I mean, it was clacking. It's not, it's not crazy loud quite yet. I think actually my torch juice is a little bit uh, louder so far right now. Same bat. This one's just a little bit heavier here. 90 miles per hour. So I have the 26 and a half pounds, but sound is great. It's got some nice, good uh, loudness to it, like a lot of the Monster clack that you would expect. Uh, in terms of feel, it feels great through the zone. I really enjoy this uh, half ounce end load on the torch. Uh, I must say, uh, I 90 miles per probably hour. Probably like this through the zone uh, a little bit more than the Monster Torch uh, two piece. With that extra half ounce end load. 91 miles per hour. All in all, feels great. Uh, in terms of pop, I mean, I think this bat is doing fantastic. I'm not, I'm experiencing, I'm not really getting a whole lot of great numbers on the radar, uh, but I take this out on the field, I like 91 miles per really hour. Really good distance on it. So I don't know if it just needs more swings before it's gonna react on the radar, or if I'm just not gonna get good numbers on it on the radar, which is fine. You know, that's found some of the anarchies as well. Oh, that's gonna be really bad. So bad it didn't even read. That's up. All right. Come on, Black Sheep, let's go. 84 miles per hour. All right, let's get a good one here. What I? 91 miles per I've hour. I've some really good distance with this bat though, so I feel like it's more in the category of those, some of those Anarchy 13 inch barrels. I don't get the greatest numbers off the radar, but I can get some good distance with it. 91 miles per hour. Uh, if you are not looking for an end load, you know, you can tell, you can feel the end load on this one. Uh, this might not be a good bat for you. Uh, you, you know, that the mid load torch uh, still a great option. 
But if you like that end mode and you've been wanting to try a monster, I mean, this is a good one to go for. The Torch Juice that only comes with 25 and a half ounce. Same bat, this, this one I got the 26 and a half. But it's time for the gamer to be unleashed. This is the Sensor 25 ounce uh, mid load one piece. Two miles per hour. Right, see, it already beat it. I didn't even get that one that good. The Sinister just. That's why it's the gamer. 92 miles per hour. Come on, Sinister. At least show us what you can do. Give it something. 91 miles per hour. Now, hopefully, by the time this releases, oh no, I don't think my website will fully be uh, launched by that point, but soon I have a website hoping to launch here. So be on the lookout for that. 92 miles per hour. Come on, Sinister, let's go! We're gonna give you one more. 94 miles per hour. There you go. That way. Oh, that wasn't good. 83 miles per hour. I'll give you one more. Ninety-two miles per hour. There you go. Yeah, I think especially too, if you wanted to try the torch, but you wanted a little bit more weight, you didn't want to do the, the 25 ounce, you know, of the torch from the 2017, 18, and 19. You wanted a half ounce end load and a little bit more weight. I mean, this is great. 26 and a half ounces. Ninety-two miles per hour. Right, see, I felt like I got that one. I was hoping that it would Come closer to the sinister. Just can't get quite there, Black Sheep. We're gonna give you one more. This is your chance. Go for it. Oh! We'll grab a 84 miles per hour. Tattoo NX3. Ninety-one miles oh. per hour. All right. Well. You know, this should last quite a long time. These are quite durable bats. Uh, feel free to leave any questions, comments down below. This is the Bat Hound, everyone signing up. Be sure to subscribe to the channel up here. Check out some other videos up here and down here. Thanks, everybody.